Alan made me the long trek from Mission Hills down to Oceanside at the Honor Bowl, where a date with defending CAF Central Division champion Colony awaited him. Alan got going right away as sophomore quarterback Brevin White connects with Johnny Edwards here for his 22 yard touchdown, putting the Warriors up 7 0. But this day was dedicated to the run game as Jordan Anderson twists his way for his touchdown in the end zone to start a big day for him on the ground. And the run game continued to shine as Guy Alfred the third takes the pitch, goes up the middle, gets away from the defender, and he is gone to the end zone. 21-0 Alamany. And Alfred wasn't done as he takes his short pitch here up the middle for another score in the second quarter for the Alamany up 28-0 at halftime. Alfred also shined on D as he had a pair of sacks leading a spirited defensive performance that punished Colony all game long because when there was one defender for Alamany, another one was right there to swarm the ball and keep the Colony offense in check the entire game. And it didn't change in the second half as Brian Berry comes up with this pick right here off Josh Thompson, helping to seal a 42-0 performance by Alamany. Honestly, this defense could do great things. You know, we obviously have a few areas we need to clean up, but they're really minor areas, you know, and I think this defense is really going to have a big impact this season. Jordan Anderson added extra sweetness on the win as the sophomore takes the pitch here from White, gets some good blocks ahead of him, and bursts to a 35-yard touchdown in the third quarter, tapping a two-touchdown day for the sophomore as Alameda will bring the honorable trophy back to the Valley. Uh, our performance was very good. I couldn't have done without the linemen. I have to give all my credit to them because without them, this whole offense would be out of control. And I just feel like I did great, and as a team, we all did good together.